guys, we're back with some more uh, Coliseum Championship Series, and this is still Season 1, obviously. And this one is yet to get started. It's about to get going. I've been, uh, well, I got the little Joker's pop-up thing or whatever. <clears throat> anyway, um, I've been waiting quite a while to find a match. For some reason, just people aren't very active today. Now, this one's a little more mid-level maybe to low level ish type deal here so let's get into it on the blue side we have a 150 echo flip already coming out the gate strong we have a 151 sram and a 132 fogger nut on the blue side and on the red side we have a 181 echo flip and we got a 121 iop and a 71 osa Alrighty then, <clears throat> let me go ahead and put my prediction in, and I'm sure you guys will probably vote the same way, maybe, if not, put your prediction down below, and then hopefully by the end of the video, you are correct. So, I'm going with the blue side, obviously. They're more balanced, um, you know, they got two, you know, mid-level 150s, um, and then they have a 132 fogger knife for a little bit of help support each style deal. Now on this side, they've got all their eggs in one basket, pretty much, in this Echo Flip. Now, if he gets a hold of somebody, he will probably do some beast damage. But, with that being said, this person's 121. She might do, this IOP might do, you know, some okay damage. But then this Osa, what's the level 71 Osa really going to do? Not a lot. So, as soon as one of these people, I mean... I'll give the, well, I don't give the Osa any props. They have no resistances, and they only have 735 health. So, as soon as one of these guys get a hold of them, they are dead. So, yeah. Hopefully you guys sided with me. Let's look at tactical real quick. We just got the, you know, four squares, so they're all hiding back here like cowards. But, you can't blame them. <laughs> Alright, so pretty much the only thing the Osa is going to do here is... Probably, oh, well, that's unfortunate. Paralyzing trap. It's just gonna buff them up. There's literally nothing else this Osa can do. Uh, it doesn't really have many good summons. Maybe if it has press brick maxed out, just kind of try to be a nuisance and steal their AP, but I don't even see that happening. Uh, these guys will just one shot it. So, pretty much this team, all they're wanting to do is just bum rush them. Um, because. The more damage they can put out quickly, this, the better off they're going to be overall. <clears throat> so, that was a pretty decent move by the Echo Flip, just getting up in there and, and hitting as quickly as possible. Now this Echo Flip here, he may drop the deeps down on this guy, but yeah, we'll see, we'll see, right? We'll see. Oh man. <laughs> The SRAM straps are doing some work. Let's get into tactical real quick. Hope it goes. Don't mind tactical too much. I just wanted to be able to see all this stuff happening. And yeah, like I, like I assumed that the second flip's going to be dropping the deeps, the DPS, pretty hard, and he did so right there. However, now he's very, very vulnerable to counter attack, and this, um, <laughs> yeah, that's. That's about all she wrote right there. <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see how this works out. But I'm confident that I'm correct in my prediction this time. <clears throat> well, my eye up. About all the eye up could do is actually pretty decent damage. I underestimated this eye up just a tad bit. Um, but. Even then, when this eye gets a turn, yeah, as soon as repercussion wears off, they're dead. But that's going to be enough to finish this guy off if this Fogger Knight doesn't finish him off first. And maybe, it depends, you have to hit a little more damage than that. Um, but let's see. Well, either way, it doesn't really matter because this, this second flip's just going to be able to kill this guy. Oh! Maybe not now, this Fogger Nuts um, may need to wear a helmet, because that was a weird, weird, weird move. Um, however, this x flip should still be able to kill him, just hit through the, the little turret there, the harpooner. 
and everything should be fine. This guy, I'm not quite sure what he is doing. The Osa, I thought he was just going to attack this guy, but there would really be no point. And there's, yeah, there's nothing they can do. And it's only a level 3 Bork Magus. Yeah. <clears throat> nothing at this point that Red Team can do. So, um, I don't know, this X flip might just like, yeah, let's go ahead and kill this person. And, uh, which necessarily is not the best move. Uh, just because this Echo Flip's gonna get a chance to drop a bunch of damage onto this, uh, SRAM. But in all honesty, it doesn't really matter, because this is pretty one-sided at this point. Oh, well, he went ahead and killed him anyway, and said, fuck it. And then... Okay, so maybe if they hit him, he won't die, but if they're smart, they just won't hit him. Uh, and then he will die. Echo Flip's luck. It's alright. It basically it gives you a turn to live, and then if you can get away, then maybe you can last longer, but eh, we'll see. We'll see. I liked how it used to be back in the day. It was just 50 50. Either it'd heal you or it'd hit you like a truck, but it's more about luck, and I guess it should be because it's called Echo Flip's Luck. But anyway, this guy just trapped the shit out of them, and they're not going to be doing a whole lot of anything. Well, well, well. Use some vitality here. Try to stay alive as much as possible. If I sound a little nasally or something like that, is I've been I've had a cold for the like past week and a half, and it's so annoying. <laughs> um, I never I didn't really mention it in the previous videos, but. I guess it would have been a good idea to mention, but either way, let's see, Envious here is just going to do some shit, heal him up a little bit, doesn't really matter at this point, you could, you could probably attack him, um, just because he has the thing on, but it doesn't matter. This turn, this Eclipse should um, kill her. The eye up. If not, I'm pretty sure the, the SRAM will be close enough to uh, get up in there. So, let's see what he decides to do here. He'll probably, yeah, okay, not, I don't think he'll kill them, uh, but he'll get pretty close. And, yeah, he's just, he's just gonna push him in the range for the, the SRAM to finish off, because the SRAM's probably over here somewhere. Ish, maybe. If not, that's unfortunate. But I would assume so. Yeah. And then... He'll just use lethal attack, and it'll be GG. Oh! 24 health! Uh-oh, he'll just use another one, and it's no big deal. So, that is game. Alright, hope you guys predicted right. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.